All right, so what is going on everyone? Swan here and today we're actually back with some uh, Diamond Dynasty and we're gonna be playing some head-to-head -head today Although we already are in the World Series division and the, the season is ending. What does it say? December 12th. We got about nine eight more days until uh, The season's over but uh, since I'm already in the World Series division It doesn't really hurt to play because I, no matter what I get the I get the rewards even if I don't end up in the division so anyways we actually do have a little pack to open real quick that we just got from like turning the game on for a certain amount of days so we're just gonna open this up and it looks like it's not gonna be anything so I didn't expect anything from that I never get anything really from those but uh, we're gonna go find a game and we got some new players uh, actually you might as well just show them right now because you're not gonna be able to see them uh, in the little loading screen but uh, anyways I did get two new closers because I got the 12 win 12 and 0 win I got this Wade Davis card I didn't buy him I actually uh, got him for more rewards in battle royale so if you want to check out the last video that's how I got him it was crazy absolutely just I, I was so nervous and then we got uh, Kenley Jansen because we did get Clayton Kershaw as the 12 win reward not the 12 and 0 win reward and we ended up selling him because we already have him and we got Kenley Jansen so we got another crazy addition to the squad and our overall team is 97 overall now so it's absolutely it's just crazy so uh, let's go to uh, a game real quick and see if we can beat someone. Alright, there we go. Finally, we got into a game. And as you can tell, we do have a 92 overall David Price as the as the fifth starting pitcher. I could have all 99s. I don't know why. I, I just have David Price there just because, I don't know, I don't really like using Bob Feller that much. Although he probably is a much better pick than David Price. Hopefully we just don't get him. I gotta turn my volume down real quick. But, uh, of course, we got, well, we got Casey Swan. I don't know if I put that in a video, but he is, I finally created a player and I'm just trying it out in right field. But, uh, yeah, we got Carlos Beltran, Joe Maurer, pretty standard. Uh, all 99s and then three more 99s down here. And we put Lou Brock in there and stuff. We still have Stanton, but then we got Kiner, Robinson, and Matthews, and, uh, yeah. I don't know. Let's go. Uh, we got Vita Blue as our starting pitcher, and we're, it looks like we're facing Steven Strasburg. Okay, and he's got Carlos, 99 Carlos Beltran at leadoff. Then he's got Griffey. Then he's got Andre Dawson, Joey Votto, Cal Ripken, Jackie Robinson, Austin Yang, his created player, and then Brooks Robinson. Pretty. It's a toss up if I. Uh, if a lefty or righty starting pitcher would be better, so I'm totally fine with getting uh, really any of my pitchers in this position. But as you can tell, well, he's 53 and 34. He's played a lot of games, but I'm only 15 and one. I did play another game last night uh, or a couple days ago or so. I think it was yesterday. But I'm 15 and one this season, and then 12 and 0 in battle royale, which puts me at 27 and one this whole season. So it's kind of just crazy. Like I don't know. I just haven't been losing at all. Um, except for one game, I think I was like 8-0, and oh, and then I lost one, and then I just won a bunch again, and it's just kind of crazy, but anyways, let's see what we can do. Haven't played, uh, much of this game a lot recently, so hopefully I'm not gonna be rusty. I did play a game yesterday and win, but his team was not very good. He was a low rank, and just wasn't really prepared, so I don't know really... <sighs> I don't know. It was it was a little easy win. I actually only got like one rating. Wow, that was a curveball right down the middle. I only got one extra rating because he was like ranked in the 300s. It was kind of crazy. But anyways, there's a strikeout for the first batter of the game. So that's pretty good. Let's throw a little change up down in here. And that's going to float right in there. Let's go a little high curveball. He's got a nasty curveball. And that's going to be filthy, and he's just going to bomb that, but it's going to be out of play. That was an absolute bomb. But uh, let's go a little two-seam inside, see if we can jam him a little bit. And I th Oh, that's not a good pitch, but that's going to be right to Roberto Alomar. Best second baseman in the game. Arguably, not, not one of the best players in the game, but hey, you could argue it. I don't know. I don't really care. He's amazing, and I'm so glad I have him, but I'm so glad I didn't have to pay full price, or pay anything for him, too, because I did get him through rewards, through the season rewards. I barely got him, 
But uh, anyways, he's got Andre Dawson up, and I think we're going to toss a little two-seam on the outside edge, hopefully. That's a pretty good pitch. There we go. Got him to foul it off a little bit. Now let's go a little fastball, a little hard fastball down and in, and it's a little too far in, but we'll take it. Now let's go a little bit of a change up. See if we can get him out in front of it. That's a good pitch. And we did get him out in front of it. He was early on it, but that's not going to be enough. Let's go another another change up up there, though. That's a good pitch. And we got him to chop at it again. He's very early that time. And now let's go a little curveball, see if we can get a little action up here. Another great pitch right to Bagwell. That's a good start to the game. There we go. No hits. And now we can see Casey Swan hit. I'm hitting really well with this player. So let's see if we can get something to hit. That was a nice slider. Nice hard slider. 88 miles an hour. That was pretty crazy. And I don't know what I'm doing. I, this is my obviously my first game of the day. And I just need to get used to this. I've got 99 speed running down the base path. And he's going to get me. I... I can't really do anything about that. I should have hit that better, first of all. That was like right down the middle. But now we got Carlos Beltran, and he's going to pop it back out. So that's not a good start. And I don't know why I'm swinging at that. I'm just, I'm rusty. I'm rusty. I just need a little bit of, a few innings. And then, I, oh my gosh, wow, yeah, I'm really rusty. I just need a few innings to get back into the swing of this whole game. Jesus. Uh, I've been playing a lot of COD recently, and there's a nice... Ripped ball, home stadium, Joe Maurer, but that's going to be an out. So, I don't know what I was doing. I was, like, building up, like, like I'd actually done something, but I obviously, uh, holy crap, I can't talk. I obviously didn't, but now we got Joey Votto up. There was a nice, a nice fastball, but didn't catch the corner, but we're just going to try and get Votto. There we go. There's out number one. Now let's see who we got next. There we go, another ground out. This one to Alomar again. Alomar's getting a lot of work in right now, getting him a lot of practice. But now we got Jackie up. Let's see what we can do. Oh, Alomar, please get this. 91 speed gets him. Three ground outs to Alomar to end that inning. Still no hits. And now we got uh, Jeff Bagwell up. Let's see if we can crush a ball with him. I did not swing right there, first of all. That was ridiculous. Come on. And Bagwell's going to pop out to whoever their first baseman is. It looks like they're created. No, it's Votto. What am I saying? Now we got Alomar up. That could be a little looper. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jam shot on Alomar. First hit of the game. Love to see it. Now we got Cal Ripken up. So let's see if we can let's see if we can hit him in. And that's gonna be a base hit. Little in between the third star third. Holy moly. It's me trying to say two things at once. Third baseman and shortstop. Uh, now we got Ken Griffey up. Ken Griffey Jr. And that's gonna be a double play. Um Wow, nice play, <laughs> Jackie. Jackie's just Grips it with one hand and just whips it over. But, uh, uh, could have done better right there. But let's see what we can do now. Again. Just the same thing. This is crazy. And there's out number three if Cal can get this play done. There we go. Perfect throw to Bagwell. Oh my goodness. This is a quick game going on. Bottom of the third already. We got Brooks Robinson up. And that's going to be a little looping. No, that's not going to do anything. That was awful, dude. I can't hit right now. I got a couple hits, but that's about it. I don't know what I'm doing. Vita Blue. Base hit. There we go. That would have been nice if Brooks had gotten a base hit and Vita gets a base hit. Dude, I'm hitting like 200 something with Vita Blue. He, like, I don't know what it is with him. I can just hit, I can hit really well with him. Now we got my creative player up. And he's going to hit one down the line. And that's going to, that's got to get, uh, Vita's got to get on his horses. He, uh, if it was a somewhat speedy player, he definitely would have gotten there. And I would have even had a chance at three with my 99 speed player. But, uh, I'll take it. Whatever. Now we got Carlos Beltran up. And he's going to do something similar, 
but we're gonna advance both runners because he made kind of a weak throw. But anyways, that's an RBI sack fly, so I'll take it. Now we got Joe Maurer up versus Strasburg, so give me something to hit. Come on. And that was that was something to hit, but I just wasn't ready for that. I don't know. I was expecting a fastball. Get going. Carry. Carry, Joe. Ah, uh, I hit it pretty hard. Decently hard. But anyways, four hits, one run. We're, we're, we're putting in work. We're putting in work. I love to see it. And Beltron hits a high shot. Right to Beltron. <laughs> right to Beltron. Same player, different team. I swear that happens so much. No! He got a base hit! Dang it, dude. I absolutely drilled it. Oh, oh, I almost got him. Wow. Uh, what am I saying? I absolutely drilled it. I pitched a perfect pitch low and inside, and he somehow got it. And how was he laying off that pitch, first of all? We're going to throw a little bit of a change up over here. And he just crushed it. He's just a little bit early on these pitches. So I'm going to keep... Oh, 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 wow. Okay. See, that that should have been a home run right there. That really should have been. And there's a decent change up in there. We're going to go a little curveball action. Perfect pitch. How do you lay off that, dude? Let's go a little, little change up again. And he's just going to be early on it every time. So... I don't even know how to pitch him. It's just he, he keeps hitting everything. Uh, there's a nice fastball. There we go. Got him. Got him. Strikeout. Love to see it. And there's Alomar again. Just getting so many plays. He's got one hit now, so I don't have to worry about the no-hitter. Or perfect game. I had a perfect game going. But anyways, now we got Bagwell up. And Bagwell is going to get a base hit right in between that third stop gap. No, the third base and short stop gap. Uh, and now we got Roberto Alomar up. Come on, let's make some more moves out here. And there could be another move. There we go. Uh, shoot, we're going to hold him. We probably should have, yeah, we should have ran Bagwell to third, but... I don't know, just kind of screwed that up. Uh, Griffey has an arm, though, so I don't know. I didn't want to test him. But let's see what we can do now. We got Cal up. Come on, give me something to hit. Give me something to hit. Not like that. I, it was a little bit too fast for me. A little bit too high and inside. Come on. One and one count. And he throws a good pitch. And now it's two, two strikes. And now he's going to throw me inside. Two and two. I'm going to do a double steal. And I knew he was going to... I knew he was going to get it in the strike zone. So Or like throw something near. So I just wanted to kind of advance the runners. I didn't want to bunt. But I wanted to make contact. And possibly get a hit and run and score in the situation. But now we got Brooks Robinson up. And Vita Blue on deck. Because he's going to intentionally walk me. So let's see what we can do. And there's a little short line drive. And we're going to advance. Hopefully. There we go. That's what I like to see. Sack fly RBI for uh, Brooks Robinson. Now we got Vita Blue up. And he's going to throw a hard slider. 91 miles an hour that time. And we're going to hit and run. And it's not going to work out quite how I wanted it to. But that's totally fine. Can't, can't expect a pitcher to go two for two to start a game, really. So, uh, I don't know. That's pretty solid. There we go. Let's see what we can do now. Cal to Griffey. And Bagwell makes the play. And there we go. Creative player to Cal. Come on. Jesus. All right. He's throwing right, right around the zone. So, I'm going to expect it to be on the edges. And not really, but that might get me on base. 99 speed beats it out. That is crazy. That is crazy fast. And we're going to steal real quick. And I was going to hit and run. Why did I do that, though? I think I definitely had the stolen base. Uh, but now he's probably going to quick pitch, and he's not. But he is going to throw a fastball, and I just wasn't ready for it. I'm stupid. That was just my fault. I should have hit that. That was not that hard of a pitch to hit. 
And we're stealing, and he throws a curveball, so we're definitely going to have that base. There we go. Let's see if he walks me. I highly doubt it, but... All right, now we got Mauer up. We're, we're down 0-1. That was a pretty nice curveball. Come on, give me something to hit. Hard slider. One and two. Come on, Joe Mauer. And that could be close to a base hit. We're not going to run home. Get back to third. All right, now we got... Uh, Bagwell up. Come on, let's drive someone in. Let's get a home run. There we go. Bagwell drills it up the middle, and that's going to score a run, and it's going to be a nice little RBI single. And now we're up like 4 1 or 3 1 or something. So that's pretty solid. There we go. Alomar to left to Beltron. And that's going to be out number three. Eight hits, three runs. Love to see it. There we go. Let's go. Oh, Brooks, Robinson, base hit. All right. Oh, Alomar. Oh, turn two. Let's go. Huge play. Oh, my gosh. Crazy play. That was amazing. Diving stop from Roberto Alomar to stop the double play and, oh, my gosh. He was on a pinch hitter, too. He's using Josh Donaldson. And it just worked out perfectly. Nice curveball right there. Let's see if we can get him with the low curveball. This thing is moving so much right now. And we did. There we go. Strikeout number probably four, maybe three. I don't know. We got a few strikeouts. That's always nice. It's kind of funny. I usually never strike out at all, like myself. I never, when I'm hitting, I usually never strike out. But when I'm, and when I'm pitching, I usually. Like every game, like a nine inning game, I'll probably average like five strikeouts or something. It's pretty crazy. Uh, but there we go. Base hit on the new pitcher, Kelvin Herrera. And that's what I like to see. There we go. We got Griffey up. We're, we're looking good out here. We're throwing a nice little shutout to start. And it looks like Griffey's going to dribble one. But I might get there. And it looks like I am going to. Infield base hit. Didn't even get past the length of the mound. And now we got Brooks Robinson up, and Brooks is going to hit it almost in the gap. No way. Jackie Robinson makes an amazing leaping catch. And what can I what can I say about that? We, we have Vita Blue right here. I'm just going to continue on with, ooh, nice bunt. I'm just going to hit with Vita, see if I can get anything going. Uh, and I kind of drilled that. Wow. Okay, Vita showing some power. And do we run? Now we're going to bluff. Beltran doesn't have the best arm out there, but we're not going to challenge him with 51 speed. And now we got my creative player up. Come on. Let me let me get a nice hit. We're going to put a power swing on it. That wasn't very good. I have Ben Revere's stance on for some reason. I just kind of like it. I like his swing. It's just fun to use. Um, but that wasn't very good. That was a bad, bad swing. I should have drilled that right there. Let's see what he gives me. And he's going to give me a, a curveball, maybe? That just dropped right into the strike zone, but... Didn't really hit it how I wanted to, but we're still we're still cruising along. They only have two hits, so let's see if we can continue this. Let's go, Alomar, right there. There we go. Pop out to Alomar. Alomar's getting a ridiculous amount of plays this game. And a pop out to Brooks Robinson. If we're still throwing a, a shutout in the last inning, I think we're just gonna have to keep going because I think Vita is a hard or a, yeah hardware legend pitcher. So it, it, it would go towards the Lincecum program, I think. So that would be key. I think that's what I need. I need complete game shutouts for that. So that would be nice. But Beltron, I got jammed a little bit, so I didn't get fully powerful on that one, but. There, whatever. There we go. Flew out to uh, Dawson, I think, out in right field. Let's go, Joe Mauer. And I... What? I thought I hit that hard. That should have been crushed. But uh, a little fly out to Beltran, I guess. A little bit off the end of the bat. And a high, high drive for Bagwell. Wow, I thought that had a chance. Uh, well, it sort of did. But warning track power for Bagwell on that one. All right, let's 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 keep mowing them down with Vita over here. Oh no! 
We let up a danger! Well, now we can use our bullpen, which I kind of wanted to do. I'm going to toss in someone right now, actually. We're going to toss in Wade Davis, use him in the 8th, and then bring in Kenley in the ninth. Let's see what we can do. I, I kind of really wanted to di like show off these pitchers. That's not a good start. But, uh, so... I don't really mind letting up that home run, but anyways, now we're gonna we're gonna show off this Wade Davis card. I didn't throw the best cutter right there, so that don't don't blame Wade on that one. Blame me. But we're gonna throw a change up. The greatest thing about this card is that it does actually have a change up rather than his live series card that only has the cutter two seam four seam knuckle curve. All right, my bad on that. Uh, screwed that up a little bit. I ran out of length on that recording time so I had to restart it but we're, we're still killing it out here come on we're gonna give him a nice little knuckle curve on the inside edge see if he well okay we popped him out that that'll work and I don't think he's gonna run on that no nah, especially not on Joe Mauer not the best throw but uh, there we go now we got Kelvin Herrera but he's definitely gonna switch to Corey Seager all right we're gonna try and go a little get uh, inside again on that cutter and I didn't do it enough again, but his, it does cut hard, so we did get him to pop out. So there's a little bit of the Wade Davis uh, that I that I did acquire from uh, Battle Royale, so it's pretty cool. And it looks like he's going to put in Dellen Batansis, who got downgraded to an 87 overall gold, which is crazy. And he's still absolutely filthy and one of the hardest pitchers to hit against in this game, as you can tell right there. His slurve is just gross, and his fastball looks like it's coming in at such a high velocity in this game. And his cutter moves a lot and goes so hard, it's just crazy. I need to get him just to get him. And he throws that freaking slurve again. I just can't hit that. Uh, we got Cal Ripken up, and he's going to throw. You see, that? it just looks like it's going so fast. It's 98, which is fast, but it looks like it's going like 110. Um, but... Looks like Cal's just going to fly out to uh, Dawson out there. Now we got Griffey up. And let's see if we can get something going right here. And I drilled it. Stay fair. And it's gone. Let's go. Absolutely drilled that from Griffey. We're going we're gonna to keep uh, Robinson and I'll take that. Hit it 107 miles an hour. See that nasty slurve, dude. I can't hit that. Do you expect me to hit that? Uh, if there's a hard 96 mile an hour cutter up, let's get a base hit so we can pinch hit for Wade Davis or hit another home run. Keep going. That's not even gonna get to the warning track, even, when it, even with it coming in right there. But anyways, we got 11 hits and four runs with a nice little dang sauce now. And I think we are gonna toss in the most deadly closing pitcher in the game today. We're going to put in Kenley Jansen, so let's see if we can do something. His his uh, his control in this game is just absolutely ridiculous. It just goes right where I want it to go, and he, he's just going to flail at that for some reason. Uh, I keep throwing these cutters that I'm just screwing up on, just not getting in enough. need to work on that, but Kenley's so difficult to hit. His delivery is amazing. He I, I just don't even know, but... Let's go a little bit of a sinker outside. Didn't really get out there, but that sinker is absolutely filthy, so I will take it. Let's go. I'm, I'm doing the same thing again. I'm just like, I'm not hitting my spots, but like I said, it's just so hard to hit. I, I, I don't know what else to say, but we got Andre Dawson up, and let's go, let's go a little inside cutter. See if we can, okay, he was a little bit early on it, because I, once again, didn't get it all the way inside. Let's go slider down low. His slider drops a ton. It's kind of filthy. And let's go high sinker to end the game. Let's go. Come on, make that play. Created player guy. He runs into the benches, and that's going to be game. So we did win again. Uh, nice little save from uh, Kenley. We got three strikeouts with him. Uh, yeah, those are some pretty good stats. Two for three with Griffey. 2 for 4 with the creative player, 2 for 4 with Bagwell, 2 for 4 with Cal. We got a lot of hits from the middle infield and not much from the back end. But he only had 4 hits, one from Jackie, his creative player, Ken Griffey Jr., and uh, Brooks Robinson. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Please drop a like if you guys did enjoy. 
doesn't really matter what my rating goes up to because I'm already past it. But uh, yeah, that's going to be it for me today. So as always, I hope you're all having a nice day and I'll see you guys later. Peace out everyone.